At the age of about 25 years, you will, send, you will be sent a letter from Public Health England to invite you for your first smear test. This will be done at your local GP practice and it's usually the practice nurse that will do this for you, who is a female. So once you receive your letter from Public Health England, if you contact your own GP surgery, they will be able to make this appointment for you. Cervical screening and a smear test are the same thing. The actual smear sampling itself only takes a few minutes. So this will involve um, inserting a plastic speculum so that it enables me to see the cervix clearly. And then I can use a cervical brush just to take a few of the cells away from the cervix and put them in the pot to send them away. There isn't anything to be afraid of when having your smear test. Uh, we have a varied range of speculums in which we can use to find one that will suit you best. The process shouldn't be painful at all. You might find it's a little bit uncomfortable. We expect that, but it shouldn't be painful. So when you attend the surgery for your appointment, that you will be greeted by the nurse that will be taking your smear sample for you. And you will be taken into a consultation room where you will have the opportunity to ask, to ask any questions or any concerns you may have. So we will ask you to undress from the waist down and lie on the couch in the consulting room. Before we do this, we will ask you if you would like a chaperone to be present for the, pr the procedure. Okay, when you're ready, let me know. Initially, we would introduce a standard size speculum, which it's not one size fits all. We would look at the patient and assess if we need to use a different size speculum and then we would um, use the cervical brush to take a few of the cells away from the cervix and put them in the pot. At this point, I would move to allow you some more privacy, enabling you to redress. So once the procedure is over, I will sit and chat with you just to make sure that you understand the process and how the results will be sent to you. Uh, these will be sent in the post via a letter you receive a letter regardless of the result, um, you will definitely receive the letter and it takes about 14 days for you to get your result. If you are negative for the HP virus, no further action will be required, you'll just be recalled in three years, which is the routine time for smears. If you have got the HPV virus, the cells will be looked at underneath a microscope in the lab. If there aren't any changes in this, you will be called in 12 months time for a repeat smear just so that we can monitor the virus. If you have got the virus and there are any changes in the cells, the, you, you will be sent an appointment directly for colposcopy where they can take a closer look. You do not need to worry about this. Very often ladies get there and actually there isn't anything to be concerned about. The cervical screening program is the smear test which literally takes a few minutes and it can literally be a lifesaver. So please, when you get your letter, make sure you come. Those few minutes of your life could literally save your life.